hello everyone in this short video I'm going to um, teach you something that saves you a lot of time if you have some animation on a uh, UE5 skeleton it is compatible with MetaHuman so you don't need to retarget it you can put it on a MetaHuman directly and I have seen a many videos on YouTube that they are explaining how to retarget uh, this animation and metahuman and they go through the painful um, and time-consuming process of retargeting you don't need to do that at all it's not necessary and even the um, animation on uh, on your engine 4 is kind of uh, kind of um, compatible and I'm going to explain so I have a couple of animation from UE5 skeleton and I want to put it on my metahuman the first thing you need to do change something on your metahuman when you are going to um, apply animation you don't want your metahuman to take the scale of the animation so you just want to apply the rotation of the skeleton to your metahuman body you want to make sure in your metahuman body you first uh, the root joint set to a skeleton and you have to um, check this the checkbox to be able to see him and you want to make sure yeah, that you set the root and pelvis on animation and the rest on the skeleton and the way you do that you select that all and right click and skeleton release after that you save it and save the metahuman and here i have animation from ue5 the only thing that you need to do is to export them and then import them again all right and you can export them as bulk so I'm going to bulk export and export them and export all actually export all so I'm going to import them again and make the human actually here and I can import them as all together And I'm going to select just MetaHuman Basic Skeleton, that's all. And we have animation for MetaHuman now. All right. And now I can test them. Yeah, sequencer, my me uh, MetaHuman, I'm going to delete the control rig and oh, sorry it's wrong okay uh, i hope that it's not going to crash because it's frozen anyway let's open it again because i don't believe that it's going to respond anytime so let's close it and open it again We have our meta human here. it to sequencer and we are going to this is face control rig this is for some reason I think I messed up with the body
Oh, I'm controlling it. Don't need controlling. And I'm going to add body. For some reason, the body. I did something to the body that it's not added here. I just want to make sure that it has um, post processing and control rig. Yep. So for some reason the body didn't come up. So now we can add the um, run, for example, here. And we have the animation. So you don't need to retarget anything. So as you can see, it's perfect. No problem. Even you can use the old animation for UE4, this one. I'm going to export it, but it's not going to actually, the fingers has a problem if you are using the old one, asset action, export, and just import it again with metahuman basic skeletal. Now we have it. And if I apply this animation, as um, you can see here, the fingers are not quite correct. So, but the rest is right, right? The rest is working and Instead of going through the retargeting process, you can actually bake it on a control rig and then fix the fingers. Thank you for watching.